Hey beautiful people, my name is Destin and welcome to my channel. So today we did another comparison video. So we're comparing two NYX concealer side by side. We have yet the NYS Can't Stop Won't Stop Concealer side by side with the NYS HD Studio Photogenic Concealer. These are both concealer looks. On this side of my face, I'll be using the Can't Stop Won't Stop Concealer. While on this side, I'll be using the HD photos, the HD Studio Photogenic Concealer. What a mouthful! Okay, guys, I've applied my foundation, so I'm just going to go ahead to apply. Yeah. I'll apply the rest of it, like the bridge of my nose, with the can't stop on stop because. I'm just going to blend the ash line with my foundation brush. So this is how the can't stop won't stop looks like. So now I'm going to apply my Studio HD Photogenic Concealer. Okay, I got this one blends. But this is how both concealer looks. So I'm going to set both concealer with my Benign Banana Powder. So I'm just going to blend before applying the setting powder. I'm using the banana the banana banana powder still. So guys, this is how the entire looks look. This is both concealer sets with the Benign Banana Powder and this is how it looks. I'm going to go ahead to finish the rest of my face and then show you guys how the entire look looks put together. So guys, my entire face is done. I just set my face with my Colourpop All Stars setting spray. So this is how the entire face looks. So this is the Can't Stop One Stop. Why this is the HD Studio Photogenic Concealer. <laughs> This is how the boat looks. So I'm going to come back in six hours time and then give you guys my general thought on these concealers. Okay, so I'll see you guys later. I'm back. The time now is 6.45. My guys, you can literally see that I'm sweating. I'm hot. And your is hot. So if this concealer does well, then hey. So I'm just going to go ahead. So this is how it looks after. This is about seven hour plus wear and this is how it looks let me just blot out some of the oil like guys i'm an oil skin girl so you can take that away from me and i'm sweating too so let's dab i think i look pretty much decent so i'm just going to quickly run down through everything so um so straight up from looking at it i don't know if you guys can see there is a huge difference the can't stop one stop side really really hold on way much better than this side if i'm going to bring you guys closer so you guys see this side is already patchy even as i try to blot it you can see it came off really really patchy i know that i know nigeria is hot and <laughs> i've not seen this concealer work like this before but hey it ain't working where this one is 
they can't stop won't stop didn't move a bunch i don't know if you guys can see it it didn't move that much it didn't cost me any crazy under my eye this did you can see product already like oof, there so that's how it looks so there's i don't need to even start going back and forth on which one is better obviously the can stop one stop one is better but if you're going for a more natural look the hd studio photogenic concealer is better because it really gives that really natural look when you just apply it and it wears a while because i have a video on that you can check that video out it wears it, it wears for a while but with this with this heat i'm going through jumping up and down dancing and all that going up and down in lagos mm -mm. This does not stand a chance with this sweat. It does not. This, I guess this is like waterproof. This is not. And this claims to be a non transfer. So, guys, spend your money on the Can't Stop One Stop. But what, the thing I noticed about the Can't Stop One Stop is that people i people, i was watching videos today now because i fit really watch any video on the can't stop on stop i watched some videos that some people were saying that it was very very drying but obviously for me it wasn't very drying it was just creamy to the right consistency so it's pretty much good so guys if you like that video and if you watched this video to the end you've gotten to this part subscribe guys then subscribe that means you like this video then subscribe and don't forget to give the video a thumbs up and i'll see you guys in my next video bye